Big local derby tonight. Um, I'm sure you're very frustrated. There's some contentious points uh, today, but just give us your, your, your take on how you feel the, the, the guys performed tonight. Yeah, I thought we was, you know, it's hard to say we actually got beat 3 1, but um, I thought we, we, you know, send off change the game. Uh, at 0 0, I think we, we're probably the better side. Um, send off two bookings. You know, there's a lot going on in the game, and he's, he's managed to. The second one's definitely spoke in the, the, the handball, and he's given him a penalty and sent him off. The first one, I think he's let a lot of them go in the game, and just just with a word, which is his first tackle. Um, and, and then, obviously, the second goal they've got, Fisky's been fouled in my eyes. Uh, referee's telling him and the centre, uh, centre of the lad is marking to keep their hands down. Uh, and then Fisky's been blocked off and right in front of his eyes, and he's not give it. And the lad's got a free header, a good header, but a free header. Uh, I thought uh, second half would come out 2 0 down, and we were a better team, and we've had a right go and got back in it at 2 1. And had a few chances, uh, and then obviously when you're pushing forward, of course, on the break with a, uh, a switch of play late on to, to win the game three-one. But I, I'm not knocking the players. If we played like that for nine games, we'd be fine. We were decent today. As you say, to concede a second goal just before half time is difficult uh, under any circumstances. Being down to ten men obviously makes life a lot harder. But you know the the, the way the guys approached certainly the first twenty minutes uh, of the second half. I mean, there was some real effort put in you must be very pleased with with the way the guys reacted certainly for the first 20 minutes yeah I, 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 yeah I, I mean you, you know the bottom line we've lost a game of football so that's the you know what it's all about um, but when you ask the players at half time to stick together to to pick your times when you go forward um, I think we've done that you know and at the moment you know I've got to be hard on the players because you know they are giving everything, but we've got to make. You've got to stop making silly mistakes and giving silly, you know, silly goals away and 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 just little bits and pieces because there's some decent play from us today. I mean, we've probably caused them a lot of problems, probably more than most have. Um, but the the first goal that they've got from the penalty, it's our throw in, and we've not at the edge of the box. We've not pushed in and let them come out too easy. And if it's on the break, and even the third goal, we've gambled in the middle of the park and they've ended up getting in at the back post. So. Little little bits and little detail in the game is costing us at the moment. And when you're down there, that's what happens. A couple of years ago, when we won the league, things went for you. That's what happens. That's what we're bogging. They're at the top, and I'm sure they're getting a fair bit of luck. That's that's how it goes, you know. And um, we've just got to make sure we're doing the, the basics right. And if we do that, we, you know, we'll be fine. Um, there's obviously been some activity um, away from the, the the pitch this week. Uh, two new guys have come in. Uh, can you tell us as much about the the, the, the new guys? Yeah, I Ibrahim uh, Ibs is the right back, right sided player. He's been um, Billericay. He's played for two years there in this league, so he's just the right sort of player we want at this club. Um, you know, we, we we've been obviously we've been trying to get someone in for a while. He, he can feel the berth right back or right midfield. And uh, Big Brandon is a, a big. He can play centre half or centre forward. You know, he's a big lad. Um, we couldn't use him today. He didn't feel very well. We come down, and he felt a bit sick, so we not used him today. But the, you know, them two have come in, and we'll still be looking this week to try and even now maybe try and get another forward into the club. Um, you know, because we're desperate to try and stay in this league, and we know it's going to be difficult. But I honestly do believe we can. Um, a run of another three home games. Yeah. Uh, we've got starting with Staines on Saturday. What's your approach going to be uh, against Staines? Yeah, no, we do listen, every game. We you know we try and get result. We. we it's been it's been difficult. We we we've um, I feel that we we got the result at Leverhead, you know, and I feel people switched off a little bit, and then we've had a few poor performances. I feel obviously last Tuesday we were decent. I thought well, day we was decent. Um, Saturday against Billericay it was just a little bit of envy boys at times, and if you come against them sort of sides, that can happen. But we we've got every game we play, and we you know we can feel we can win, and the players need to believe in themselves because I do believe there's talent in the change room, and we just said like after you know you've got to stick together. Um, stop the silly mistakes and we will get results well I so say we wish you all luck on Saturday and uh, hopefully we'll, we'll be talking after three points cheers guys thank you cheers.